welcome back to Calypso Moon. Welcome in if you're new. Aries, we're doing your reading. I will be using these rune stones to get your overall energy or just some different insight. Then I'll clarify with some tarot. All right, Taurus. I'm Taurus. <laughs> I can't get over Taurus. Like I could. I guess I'm just gonna keep doing that reading forever. <laughs> Every damn reading, almost. I'm like Taurus. Taurus. Aries. Let's get your room some reading. Okay, so I'm getting that Kevin Gates song, Money Long, but my longer cell phone. Yeah, I'm seeing some money here. Somebody could be uh, using their musical skills here to get money. Wealth, should I say? Something's unknown. Okay, so somebody tried. Let's just say that somebody could have been an up and coming musician or rapper or singer or something here. And they're trying to use their money to get fame and fortune, I feel like. But things definitely ain't happening the way they thought they would. I'm getting something here. Something here is insurmountable. But then there's an unknown over here. Somebody doesn't have a strong following. All right, let's see what the tarot says. What does the tarot have to do? I really wanted to go outside today, but I didn't. Oh, well, damn. Prove me wrong then. Yeah, somebody's doing something they really love, something that makes them emotionally fulfilled. Somebody could be getting some good news coming in from a credible source. So we got knights both over here. So you're getting some messages coming in. So the message is coming in fast and it looks like it's going to be good news. Another night, something that was going slow or something that you've been methodically working on. Okay. Mm. Oh. So we got the five of cups at the bottom of the deck in reverse. So spirit is saying something that you might have regretted before. You're not going to regret now. Um, I'm hearing somebody's gaining traction. Somebody has their eye on the prize. We got the ten and the nine of cups. I'm getting somebody got big dreams, big aspirations, but this is going to take preparation. Damn, did I just make up a rap right now? <laughs> big aspiration, big preparation. Okay, look, I can't rap. Just shut up. <laughs> so somebody definitely could be trying to be a rapper here for real. I'm also getting that somebody lost their joy for this. Really? Maybe somebody didn't want to put the work in for it no more. Maybe they weren't really passionate about it anymore. But I see that this passion is coming back. This, this fulfillment is coming back from this. 
So there could have been an opportunity. Show me this empress. You might have created something that was very create creative. We got the ten of wands in reverse with the seven of wands in reverse. There could have been something here that was blocking your creativity, but whatever it is, it's gone now. You walked away from it. What is this? Uh, six of cups? Or four of cups? What am I talking about? Okay, I'm getting somebody was fighting their manifestations here. You were waiting and waiting for something to line up or get into place, but there was an internal battle or some the competition was too strong. Either or. Okay, so I feel like you and a family member or somebody that you got a lot of love for is uh, coming up with a plan. So I see collaboration and planning. Yeah, Ten of Cups again. Yeah, Spirit is saying this this could be very successful for you. But somebody's watching for your downfall. Oh, shit. So, yeah, there's definitely somebody else, a third party in the mix that you could have been mixed up with that was blocking your creativity. This could have had you stuck or moving at a slow pace. Somebody wasn't using their intuition here. They weren't seeing the light of what they needed to do. Now we got the emperor. I feel like things are lining up for you. You could be working with somebody or now you're delegating the work. Okay, so we got the page of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, there's some definite immature energy here with the page of wands the five of swords and the page of pentacles in reverse also somebody could have been uh being a father or a mother in this situation and that's what was holding them back from their passion we got the moon in reverse mm. i'm also getting that somebody could have been getting manipulated by a king of wands this could be a fire sign, or this could be you, or you could be dealing with another fire sign, somebody who's running shit. How are you hating from outside the club? You can't even get in. Let go. Ten of Pentacles, wow. So yeah, things, uh, spirit is about to balance this situation out by giving somebody, wow, truth, clarity, and love, the spotlight. Damn, two aces. So I'm, I'm seeing that somebody's finding out who really loves them. And this is about to lead to their abundance and their justice. Yeah, somebody been uh, keeping somebody going in circles, acting like they were supporting them, but they really wasn't. Somebody breaking out of a contract here or getting good news about being released from a contract or somebody could have been shadow banned or blocked or some shit like that. And now they're being released. We got the five of cups again. Or this is what could have stopped somebody's career because I'm seeing five of cups, um, ace, of pen ace of pentacles, and then the six of wands in reverse. So somebody regrets not taking an opportunity when it was presented to them because this could have led to their fame and fortune, but it's in reverse. And now we got the nine of wands here. So this is what happened in the past. But somebody's getting some good news. They're partnering. They could be partnering with somebody. Oh. Yeah. Somebody is lining up or making alliances with somebody else now. 
yeah, that's going to lead to some type of happiness and wish fulfillment. Oh, wow. We got the king of wands at the bottom of the deck again. So it's like um, where somebody was unknown, they took a pause and now I feel like they're ready to come back. Somebody's formulating a plot to come back stronger, wiser, and better than before. I feel like somebody got Gemini in their chart somewhere or you could be dealing with somebody who has Gemini in their chart. What's the advice there? So Spirit saying, don't tell everybody your wishes and dreams or even your next moves. Protect yourself and your ideas. Yeah, watch who you're working with because these are dream killers. I knew that was going to happen. All right. Then we got the Ten of Swords. Yeah, people will backstab and, and betray you. Yeah, you're not vetting these people. You need to start vetting these people with the Hermit in reverse. You don't never tell them what you really truly want or what you're really truly working on because they're going to stab you in your back. Ten of Swords. All right, that's what I have for you, Aries. I really wish you guys the best on this situation. Let me know if this resonated for you guys. Uh, somebody trying to get into the industry. All right, I really appreciate you guys. Hit that like button on your way out. Thank you for your support, and I will see you on the next one.